my name is Jay Siraki, and I'm, I'm here to talk about small and medium-sized enterprises in North Africa and the Middle East. And what are the challenges affecting SMEs today? It's easy to find $50,000 to start a business, but to take your business from there into the next levels, it gets harder in the $200,000 range. At the one to five million range, where you need to go into your third market, get up to a scalable size business, it's very, very difficult. It's too small for venture capitals, there's not enough private equity, and there's not enough elements of getting the people with the funds into the entrepreneurs. Corporations are sitting on billions in cash because they're too scared to invest it in private markets right now, but they're not investing that into the SMEs. The other thing I, I, I've learned in talking with my peers and I, and I think is, is, is very important is finding what's the right type of fit. Now fit can come in many different planes, not just fit for your product to market, but it's, it's the fit of mentoring systems to the young on, entrepreneurs and small and medium sized business, the fit of skill sets and the skill sets coming out of the local markets and the universities, et cetera, and how do those fit inside small and medium sized enterprise. You need that, that roadmap in order to figure out how to do expansion because at an SME level, employing two to three people isn't putting enough impact on the greater economy. You need to get those scaled up to 100 person, 1,000 person, et cetera, employments. So you need to entice business in order to be responsible to invest in SMEs. Profitable returns are not the only way to gauge your investment. You need to look at the longevity, you need to look at the stability of it, you need to look at what you're giving back into economies that have given you your profit to begin with. Educate the investors, and then you need to, be able to link those investors with the entrepreneurs, because there's no, there's no lack of spirit, but there's a lack of guidance, and you need to just work on that in order to take your SMEs from the incubation stage up into a middle stage and up into a long-term profitable business.